Hi kids on, I'm Mr. Tom, and today we're going to talk about heroes and adventure. So in order to do that, we're going to go to the woods. To the woods! To the woods. Today's story is about when Moses and the Israelites made it to the edge of the promised land. In order to see what was there, Moses sent in 12 leaders, strong, capable, wise, intelligent men, to go scout out the land to see that was there. The leader of those 12 men was Joshua. His right hand man was a man named Caleb. And then there was 10 other guys. Now, the 12 spies ran around the land for 40 days checking stuff out. They explored the flats, they explored the hills, they explored the wonderful vast foliage and the beautiful sunlight, and they saw lots of good land for their crops, and they saw lots of good land for their livestock, and they saw lots of hills to run up and down, because who doesn't love running up and down hills? And then they also saw giant, giant, giant grapes. Grapes as big as your head. <laughs> Hilariously huge grapes. And to go with the giant grapes, they found giant giants. And as they explored, they kept running around, looking for stuff, looking for things, seeing what was there. Remember, 40 days, that's a lot of exploring. And they also found enemy cities, big, scary, thick walled, tall, impenetrable forces. And they thought to themselves, oh my scary goodness, that was big. And then they went back home. Now when they got back to the camp with Moses and the Israelites, they had a sit down and the 10 spies said, no, this is a bad idea. We can never take the land. The giants are scary and the walls are scary. And Joshua and Caleb said, oh man, we can totally take this land because God is with us and God is super awesome. Yeah, welcome. 12 people went to the promised land who did what God wanted them to do. Two, Joshua yeah. and Caleb. What happened because the 10 didn't obey God? They had to wander the wilderness. For how long? 40 years. 40 years. That's a long time. What, what did Caleb and Joshua do that the other 10 people didn't do? Trust in God. Yeah, the other people didn't trust him. Which was the better choice? Trust in God. Even though, whoa, even though it was scary? Mm -hmm. Even though there were giants? Mm -hmm. Even though there was giant walled cities that'd be super hard to take over? Yeah, but I would say, <laughs> God is. But I would be breathing like raven. Is it still trusting in God if you do what he says, even if you're scared? Yes. What do you think, Ellie? Yeah. Okay, kids zone. Thanks for watching. I uh, hope you remember to trust in God, even when it's hard and even when it's scary. And I will talk to you next week. Next week will be our 20th kids zone online video. That's a lot of kids zone online videos. Hope you're enjoying them. Love you guys. Bye.